Are you a little leprechaun? Hey guys, so I was gonna totally skip over St. Patrick's Day this year and then Presley learned about leprechauns in preschool yesterday. Leprechaun. A leprechaun? She cannot stop talking about them to anyone who will listen. A leprechaun and then a leprechaun. So I did some Googling, here we go. I'm Elle and I'm passionate about filmmaking and finding ways to be a great mom. I remember my mom doing leprechaun footprints when I was little and it had such a big impact and literally took me three minutes. Let's give it a try. I did the washable finger paint, used the side of my fist and then my pinky for the toes. <laughs> Presley was really surprised. Who did that? A leprechaun! <gasps> and he was so nice to lay out that paper towel. Yeah. The funniest thing, Ross was like, did you use Ford's feet for that? I'm like, no. <laughs> but that would have been a good idea. Food coloring. This is what we made for breakfast. I'm just kidding. Our version was much grosser. Green eggs. What happened? I wouldn't even eat them. A leprechaun. You really oh. realize how yucky food coloring is when you have to add it yourself. They do make a, a, a natural alternative. However, I checked three stores, including Whole Foods, and couldn't find it. So if you're interested, you might want to get that online. Second thing I did, because I randomly had just gotten pesto, is switch out the spaghetti from the red sauce to the green. I feel like Presley really got a kick out of this. I don't come to green. She didn't want to eat the green pasta though. Oh, Third, what we're trying tonight is to put drops of food coloring in the bottom of the glass so that when you pour milk in, it changes to green. We'll see what Presley thinks. Okay, and then finally, we are building a leprechaun trap. Uh, there are some really elaborate ones online. I feel like I could get totally into this when Presley's a little bit older, but this year, we used a Kleenex box. Everyone's like really sick in my family, so we have lots of empty ones. I'm putting this. Putting tissue paper around it. It's Pinterest worthy. Yeah, so you can't see the hole. There you go. The leprechaun is just gonna fall in. Cookie. Ah! Ah! Great, now we wait. I think the leprechaun was here, guys. <gasps> he got away, Presley, look. He's gonna somehow get out. Dental floss to climb out. But he'll leave behind something. Is that green poop? Look. So that's it. Let me know if you guys have any easy St. Patrick's Day traditions in the comments. And also be sure to check out Meg's delicious green-inspired chocolate chip mint frozen yogurt. Oh, Andy, it's so good. It's so good, OMG. Finally, thanks for being so nice about my uh, day in the life last week. It's my first time vlogging. I really was kind of nervous uploading that, and you guys are really sweet, so maybe I'll do it once a month. I will see you next week. Bye, guys. I love Coricon. I love Coricon. I love Coricon.